Run them numbers back, I lost count in the lobby It's your boy EJ. Uh, I've been y'all been highly requested this video. Uh, y'all wanted to see my gaming setup video, so I would decide to make this for y'all. Yeah, I got my girl on the camera, so let's go. I'm gonna show y'all all my gaming setups, uh, all my gaming setup, and I'm gonna show you what you can use if you just now starting off gaming, if you wanted to get into streaming and everything like that. So here we go. It's my gaming room over here. This is my gaming room right here, y'all. So the first thing I want I want to do is uh, make sure you have like some type of phone. You know what I'm saying? I don't have the best phone. I still got to phone my room out a little bit more, but uh, make sure you have phone like whatever space you in. Make sure it's like phoned out. That way you can get the best quality of your microphone. Because a lot of people that streams uh, when they talk into the mic, it sounds like an echo or it sounds like they're in the hallway or something. So make sure you got like phone so the the voices and stuff, your voice won't be bouncing off the wall. Uh, you can get these on Amazon for like $50, $50 for 50 pieces. So, or $60 for 50 pieces or something like that. I have everything in the description so y'all can see it. Uh, coming over here, uh, this is my stream room, as y'all know. Um, I wanted my stream room to be something I could, uh, I can come in here and I can chill if I wanted to, or I can eat, or I can do things like that. So I bought this chair, this desk. This is not a gaming desk. This is a, a, a office desk, but it's made for gaming. Like you can put gaming, you can do your gaming stuff over here. But I wanted a big desk so I can uh, so I can be able to put a lot of things on there because I, you know, I have three monitors. I got, you know, my PC, my cooler, my, you know, everything on here. So. This desk right here I got from a, a store called Office Max. I don't know if y'all got one in y'all city, but you can uh, go on Amazon and find this desk. This desk for me was like 300 and something dollars. Uh, it was about maybe eight months ago when I bought this desk, so it's probably a little cheaper than that now. But this is the office desk. It goes from here all the way around. So it shapes like a U, it shapes like a U. But yeah, uh, I got my ring light right here. This ring light right here is, um, is uh, from Best Buy. I bought this from Best Buy from like seventy dollars. Um, I wanted some light to bounce off me. You know what I'm saying? As a streamer, you want the you want the most light. You want the most light. You wanna you wanna make sure you get the most light so your camera can pop out. You know what I'm saying? So you can have the best HD quality of your camera to come out. You know what I'm saying? So I got this ring light bounce, bouncing off of me when I'm streaming. It's like seventy bucks. You don't need you you don't need this, but. Uh, you can get this to start off with, you know what I'm saying? You can get a ring light to start off with. You don't need Elgato lights. I have two Elgato lights right here. These are my two Elgato lights. And um, these right here run, uh, these run these run $1.99 a piece on Amazon. So 200 bucks a piece. Uh, they are well worth it because this light right here is, this is like the best light and it doesn't overheat. These lights don't overheat. And you can use them for almost anything, you know, if you streaming or whatever, you know, taking pictures or whatever. But these are a must, you know. But if you can't afford that Elgato lights, then just go with the ring light for like 70 bucks. Get a ring light, get like two ring lights, and you know, that should be fine for the time being. Especially if you get just got a webcam. If you got a webcam, this should be fine. Um, if you got like a, a DLSR camera, like I got, then you might want to get more lighting to bring out that HD quality. Um, the next thing I want to show y'all is my piece, uh, is my monitors, my monitors. Uh, no, not, not the monitors yet. My gaming chair. This gaming chair is a Cougar Racing uh, uh, gaming chair. Uh, I bought this from uh, a place in Houston called Fry's Electronics. Uh, they closed down now, but at the time this chair was like 400 bucks Like 400, huh? Yeah, like 400 bucks. So I paid like 400 for this. You can go on Amazon and get something way cheaper But uh, the quality is real good, you know, so remember you get what you pay for, you know, so if you want <clears throat> if you want Something like this is probably gonna cost a little bit more but if you can find another gaming chair, you can get another gaming chair with, with you know, with some decent quality for like $150. Uh, 
you know so i'll leave a this i'll leave a description uh of how much this is and all the stuff in here under in the description so make sure y'all pay attention um next that i want to talk about my monitors i have three asus monitors three asus monitors matter of fact um matter of fact i'm gonna walk over here to my closet and get and get the box because I keep all the boxes to everything I get. I keep all the boxes, so I'm gonna walk over here to my to my closet. So this is what I have. If you can see, let me come over here. As you can see, I have a Asus MG278 278 uh, gaming monitor. It's one MS. Make sure your Monitor is 1ms so you can get the fastest reaction time. Make sure it's 1ms um, This is a 2560 by 1440 So this is like What 2kd? I'll say 2k. I took no it's uh, HD You know, so make sure it's like that um, This is it's 144 gigahertz uh refresh refresh rate so this is the, the more refresh rate the more gigahertz the better the the better the uh monitor is so make sure you do that this is right here is the the game visual it's the game visual this is the eye care you know so it doesn't messes with your eyes um uh, it's a five-way navigation joystick you can use different joysticks on it if you want to uh uh this is just showing that you can dismantle it you know, you can come off and you can, you know you can put it on a tripod or something like that, anything. And it can turn, it can twist in a four way. So you can put your, your monitor horizontal if you want to, or you can put it like I have it. I got a 27 inch and it's a 27 inch widescreen, 27 inch. Uh, let me put this down, right here. So these right here are gonna be like 500 and something dollars a piece. Uh, I got these, like I said, I got these like eight months ago. You might want to check and see. I'm, I'm gonna put the description. I'm gonna put the like the real price down below. But at the time, they were like $565 a piece. That was including tax. This one and this one. Now this is a 24 inch monitor right here, which is an Asus. But this one was like 200, and, like 200 and something dollars, like $230. This was my fate, my first gaming monitor. This is my first gaming monitor. I started off with, and I end up keeping it. Uh, I'm eventually upgraded uh, real soon. Maybe this month I'm gonna upgrade it. Uh, but right now I got two 27 inches and I have one 24 inch. So these two are like 500, 500 tax plus tax, and this one is like 230 dollars. Uh, but I'll put the description. I put it. I put every all the prices down in the description. Um, the next thing I wanna uh, say, I got my keyboard. My keyboard is a Corsair. I think it glows and it lights up uh, in the dark. It's real cool. Uh, I like it and I got the mouse to go with it. This right here was like, the the keyboard was like $60 and the, the mouse was like $30. So I really like it. It comes out like this if I wanna type or something and I can push it back in like that. You know what I'm saying? That's what I like about this desk too. Next thing I want to say, I want to talk about is my mic. This mic is the best microphone you can get. This is the best microphone you can get as a streamer, as a podcaster. You seen Agent, you seen Agent uh, on his podcast with these mics. Uh, Cuban has one of these mics. Uh, actually, Cuban is the one that told me about this mic and told me I should get this mic because I asked him what's a, the best mic. So shout out to Cuban for recommending this mic to me. This mic is the Shure SM7B. It's a great microphone. It's the best investment I ever made. This mic right here will make your voice sound crystal clear. This mic right here retails at $400 plus tax. So like $430. Um, I got the boom stand. This is a Rode NT, I mean a Rode PSA1 uh, mic boom stand. So this right here, you can bring it out like that. You can bring it up. You know, come out like this, like that. You know, any anytime you, I, I put it up like this, whenever I'm ready to leave out my stream, I put it up like that. And when I'm ready to stream, I just take it out and talk on it like that. You know. So that's a good one. I like that. I like that mic so, uh, a lot. Um, the stand is like a hundred dollars. 
and the mic is like four hundred and thirty dollars. Um, but if you just starting out, if you just starting out as an up and coming streamer or any or a podcaster, you can go with a Blue Yeti. A Blue Yeti is still a decent mic. You can also go into OBS Studios when you're ready to stream. Go into OBS Studios and tweak the mic with compression and the noise gate and everything. You can tweak the mic to make it sound just a little bit better. If you got, if you're working with a a, a Blue Yeti, uh, if you get a if you get one like I have a Sure SM7B, you don't have to do a lot of that. You don't have to go into the settings and tweak with the mic to make sure your voice just sounds good. Uh, this is a great microphone. Um, Next thing I'm gonna talk about is my, without, but remember, remember, you cannot use this microphone, repeat. I repeat, you cannot use this microphone without an interface and a preamp. You need an interface and a preamp. This is not a USB microphone. A Blue Yeti, if you get a Blue Yeti, then that is a, a Blue, I mean, that is a, a, a USB. So a blue, a, a, blue Yeti, a blue Yeti is just like a plug and go. All you gotta do is plug it into your PC or whatever and you can use it. But with this mic, you need an interface. You can need an interface. This interface right here is a Focus Strike Solo. A Focus Strike Solo right here. Uh, and you need the Cloud Lifter. You need a Cloud Lifter. This is the Cloud Lifter. This one is like 200 and some bucks. This is like 100 and some bucks. I will link everything down in the description so y'all can know where to go get all this stuff at. Um, what else? Um, I have an Xbox One X. I have an Xbox One X, and um, but you know the new Xbox and the PS5 coming out, so I'm going to get both of those. Uh, but if you're going to get an Xbox, you you should already know how much an Xbox costs. You know, uh, if you don't, uh, they just, you know, I'll put it down in the description, but if I were y'all, I wouldn't go invest into an Xbox X. I'll just wait for the new Xbox or the new PS5 to come out, or just keep what you got, because it's, you know, if it's working for you, then don't, you know, you don't have to trade it in, or go try to buy another one. Uh, I have a PS5, I have a Xbox Elite controller, and a PS4 Scuff controller. Now, I know what y'all thinking, y'all like, EJ, why you got a PS4 controller, but you don't have a PS4 up here? Well, I got this little thing. Oh. This little thing is called a Cronus Max Plus. It's called a Cronus Max Plus. This Cronus Max Plus allows you to play with any controller you want to play with. You can play with a PS4 controller on the Xbox. You can play with a Wii controller on the Xbox. You can play with any controller that you want or vice versa. All you need is this Cronus Max Plus. And you can link your, and you can plug in your uh, PS4 controller on Xbox. So say if you have, say, so say if you uh, you like PS4, and you, but you want to play Xbox with your friends, but you don't, but you don't like the Xbox controller, just buy one of these, buy Cronus Max Plus, and you'll be able to play with your PS4 controller on Xbox. So um, this right here is like 70 bucks. The Cronus Max Plus is like 70 bucks. You can go buy it uh, from Cronus Max Plus. Um, Next, my Elgato lights. I know I talked about my Elgato lights, but the cool thing about my Elgato lights is this right here. This right here is a stream deck. This stream deck allows me to uh, hit buttons on the fly. So I can go to YouTube and it's gonna open up YouTube right here. Let me click out of this. It's gonna open up YouTube. So I click YouTube, it's gonna open up YouTube. If I click Gmail, it's gonna open up my Gmail right here. So that's the cool thing about that's the cool thing about uh, the stream deck, and also the stream deck allows me to cut on my stream lights anytime I want. So I, all I got to do is click this button right here, and then it's gonna cut it on. If I click it again, they're gonna cut off. That's what I like about it. Everything is on the fly with a stream deck. I recommend streamers get this stream deck. Uh, being that you don't have to do things manually from your keyboard, you can just press a button and it's automatically gonna do it for you. So this stream deck right here is like a hundred bucks and you can get it from Amazon or Best Buy. I'll link it down in the book. I'll link all the prices down in the description. All right, next, I wanna talk about my camera. My camera is a Canon T7i. Let me get the box so I can show them over here. Let me get the box. Right here. My camera is a Canon. A Canon EOS Rebel T7i. 
these Canon cameras go for $7.99 plus tax, so like $830, $850. Bucks. It's a DLSR camera, and it's like 24 megapixels. Uh, and it's a great camera. It's a good camera. It's a, it's, I mean, it's a real good camera. If you saw any of my Twitch streams, then you know how the clarity on this camera is. It, I mean, it shows crystal clear. So, uh, this is a Canon, a Canon T7i. Now, remember, you cannot use a DLSR camera without this. Let me go around here. Cam link. This right here is a cam link. Remember, you can use a webcam. A webcam. You can use a USB webcam to start off with. To start off with, you can use a USB webcam, a, a Logitech, a Logitech 1080p webcam, or a Logitech 4. Uh, I mean, a Logic Brio 4K webcam, um, which is USB, and you can just plug it in your PC and and you will have a camera. But as far but for a DLSR camera. You need a cam link. This cam link runs at $300. I know it's expensive, but you probably can find some used ones on there for like maybe 200 or something like that. But a new cam link is 300 and something dollars. Now you need a cam link. You need this cam link in order to stream with the uh stream with the uh the DLSR camera. All right? Cam link. I will link it down below. All right. So, and I got that out of the way. All right, so I got all that out of the way. Now the next is, I'm gonna leave my PC for last. The next is my bobbleheads at the top. You know what I'm saying, y'all probably don't care. But these are my bobbleheads at the top. I go to GameStop and get some bobbleheads. And you know, just to make the stream room more, you know, stream roomy, I guess you could say. This is my big monster mask. It's for all y'all day ones that's out there that know EJ. Know that I used to put this mask on every Saturday for Monster Squad Sub Saturday and run with all my supporters, man. So uh, I keep this mask. I don't wear it no more, but I keep this mask just to remind me where I came from. Selena, what's wrong? All right, so um, I have my cooler. This right here is my cooler. Now inside my cooler, inside my cooler, come on close to it. Inside my cooler. Uh, you know, when I'm gaming or whatever and I'm thirsty, I just come over here and open up my cooler. I open up my cooler and I have Fiji water, I have vitamin water, I have Sprite. Uh, so anything I want to just drink, I can just open up my, my cooler and I can drink it. You know what I'm saying? This is what I love about my stream room that I can just, you know, I can, when I'm gaming and I'm thirsty, I can just, you know, get a water or something. I got my hats up here and, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm not gonna put this in the description. I'm not gonna put this price in the description, bro. I'm not gonna put this price in the description because a lot of y'all that starting off streaming, y'all probably don't even care about a cooler. But for all those that do want a cooler in their gaming setup, I'll put the link below. I'll put the link below. But this right here was like uh, 200 and some bucks or 300 for the cooler. It was, uh, I like it though. It's, 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 it's very essential for me because, you know, when I'm in here, I, I, I'm gaming and I like to get a drink of water and I just open up my cooler and, and, and drink. My PC has been built. Oh! Oh, you just reminded me. Okay. My girl's pointing down saying you forgetting something. My Elgato! This is an Elgato green screen. My Elgato green screen is from Elgato, of course. From Elgato. I love Elgato. Shout out to Elgato. They make great, they make great uh, products for streamers. Uh, so, this Elgato green screen goes up like this. Whenever I'm ready to stream, I just pull this up like this. You can look. So I got my Elgato green screen. So I can sit down like this. Sit down like this. Cut on my lights. And I got my green screen right here. And I'm ready to go right here. This monitor right here is for gameplay. This monitor right here is for my chat. And the, and the right monitor is to check my OBS to see that my stream is good, that I'm not dropping no frames or nothing. So that's how I got it over here. But this Elgato green screen is good. Now, you don't need to get this one from Elgato. You can just buy one that's like a sheet, a green sheet and like nail it on your wall or something like that and you can use that. But um, like I said, if you want professional, you want to be professional about it and get and get all the right stuff and the decent stuff and the stuff that that you don't have to keep upgrading, then I will go with this. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and it goes down. 
Just like this. It goes down, it goes up. It goes down, it goes up. Just like this. So, and then I just close it up like that. Now, the next thing is my PC. I know y'all can't see it right now because my monitor is in the way. You know what, let me turn this one sideways. All right, I just turned my monitor sideways, just like y'all can see. I turned my monitor sideways. Uh, so y'all can see my PC. So look, my PC is built. This is not a PC I bought off of CyberPower or whatever you call that website or NXZT or NZXT. These, this is not it. This right here has a lot of stuff in it. This right here is my baby. This right here is the Holy Grail. This is my 1080 Ti. This is my 1080 Ti gaming graphics card. I have 32 gigs of RAM. I have a Xeon 2667 B3. Clocks at 3.2 gigahertz. I will link it down in the description. That is my CPU. My CPU is a, I think a Z, a Exxon, I think that's how you say it, Exxon 2667. B3, uh, and it clocks at 3.2 gigahertz, man. And this is a, a Vega, uh, full tower, full tower PC. Uh, it shows me my cooling, how cool, how cool it is in here. This is the cooler. If I wanted to kick on another fan, all I gotta do is hit that, and it clicks on another fan. It just, it's just a great, it's a great PC. And this is my GLI gaming motherboard. It's a G1 gaming motherboard that I'm that I have up there. And it lights up, and it lights up with all this stuff. It lights up. Let me cut the lights off so y'all can see it. This is how I look at night. That is how it looks at night. You know, so yeah, that is my that is my my uh my PC. My PC is around my PC is like five thousand. I pay like and for all everything for my parts and everything. I pay like five thousand dollars. I will link all of it in the description. I will link all of it in the description. So yeah, this is my gaming setup. Uh, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, remember, if you are a up and coming streamer, all right, you need a green screen. You need a green screen, okay? So get your green screen. Get your green screen. Put it on the wall. Nail it to the wall if you have to, or get your Elgato green screen like the one I have. I'll link it in the description. All the prices and everything I use, all my equipment, will be in the description. Uh, follow my Twitter, Goddamn EJ, G A A A T, uh, Damn EJ. Follow my Twitter, follow my Instagram, Yo That's EJ underscore, and follow my Twitch for daily Twitch streams at Yo That's EJ. Um, I've got a lot of videos on the way, so I know y'all wanted to see a game setup to a uh, video, so. This is my room. This is my my. This is my stream, and, and I mean, this is everything I use right here. So um, I love y'all, man. Make sure you hit that. Com make sure y'all comment if y'all want to know anything else. Make sure y'all like up this. Uh, the make sure y'all like the video and subscribe to it, man. Thank y'all for watching, and uh, I hope this helped y'all. And uh, I'm gonna catch y'all later, man. Yeah.